Hey everyone, how are you today? Today I'm filming a new kind of video which is fun for me. It's like a do-it-yourself video which I haven't filmed anything like that before and it's not so much do-it-yourself in the way of like craftiness but it's like a do-it-yourself gift idea and today I'm filming a do-it-yourself manicure gift set idea which you can definitely use as a gift or you can use it for yourself whatever you prefer my little sister's 16th birthday is coming up on Valentine's Day actually and she loves nail polish and doing her nails as much as me so I thought about what I could get her and like I could get her nail polish and stuff like that but that's not so much fun on its own so I figured I would create a like a manicure set with all of like the essentials you need for doing your nails so I also thought that I would share this with you guys in case you're interested in creating your own manicure set or if you have someone that you're looking for a gift idea for I thought that this would be fun it can be as expensive or inexpensive as you want just depending on what you include in the actual set so <clears throat> First of all, let me show you what I got and then I'll share like some alternatives. And I keep looking over here because I'm actually using different lighting today. I like shot one of the, or I didn't use one of the overhead lights so I don't know if it's too dark. But let me know how this lighting is compared to the other lighting, if you like it or if you hate it or whatever. So, okay, so first of all, I was looking for like a cute basket or container or something to put all of the stuff in. And I couldn't, I didn't know like what size to get. I picked up different sizes. So this is for your first step. You're going to need like a container or a basket to put all of the Stuff in. So this is the one I got. It's pretty big just because I wanted it to be big enough to fit everything I want and it's from Target. It's actually from the little kids section over in like the little girls room section I saw it. It's really cute. It has hearts on it and since her birthday's on Valentine's Day I thought it was perfect. So it's like a plastic shoe box and the lid just snaps on and off but you guys can definitely go with whatever kind of container you want. Even if you just want to throw all of the stuff in a gift bag that definitely works great. This was probably like seven dollars which isn't too bad. So this is the case I got, and basically what I'm going to do is just fill it with all of the things I got for the manicure set. So, some essentials you're going to need. First of all, you're going to need nail polish remover because you definitely want nail polish remover in any kind of set that you're going to get. And I got this one from Zoya which um, I really like this one. It kind of spilled a little bit when it was being shipped because I recently got some from Zoya like this and I like it because it has a pump on it and me and her had been talking about nail polish remember like that for a while so I really wanted to get her this but um, this was $10. If you want to save some money, definitely go with like a cheaper alternative and just get regular nail polish remover for like a dollar, which works great too. But I really wanted to get her this because it was her birthday. It's something special. It has a pump on it and we had been talking about that for a while. Then also... Um, you want to get something to take the nail polish remover off with. So I just got these cotton rounds from Target. They're just like this and they're little cotton balls like this. Um, or they're cotton pads. You could get cotton balls. You can get whatever you want. These are super cheap, like $2 or something like that. Then I got these because I love these for my manicures. They are just, um, what are these called? Cotton swabs or Q-tips. But the top of them are pointed, if you guys can see that, which I think are great for getting the nail polish off like the edges of your fingers and things. So I thought these were great. I got these from Sally Beauty Supply. You can also get them at Target or you can just go ahead and get regular Q-tips if you want to add those in, which are also super cheap. All of these like tools that I'm showing you are definitely really cheap. They're all like a dollar to two dollars. Then I got these nail nail care sticks which they're just pretty much um, cuticle sticks to push your cuticles back. I thought that these were really great. These were like a dollar also. Um, I definitely like to use those when I'm giving myself a manicure. Then you definitely also need a nail file which you can use. Find a nail file, or not, find a nail file for like a dollar anywhere. And I like these ones personally like the metal ones with the plastic handles and the point on the end I think are really great. So I got her one of those and then also I got her one of these which are like emery boards and um, these are great too if you really want to file. Some people prefer these over like the metal ones so I also got her one of these and it comes with like a really cute case. This was also like a dollar from Target as well. Then I got her this just like a nail cutter which was from Target. I think this is like one or two dollars as well. And I mean all of this stuff is optional but I think these are definitely great things to include into like a basic manicure kit because you'll get so much use out of these things. I love this thing, this buffing block. I had fake nails for a while and I went back to my real nails and this buffing block is amazing. It has like um, four sides and you use it just to like buff your nail bed and shine it. I think this works great and I think it's like a manicure essential. Anyone, even you, if you guys want one of these will love this. It was super cheap, like a dollar or two. Then while I was there I also thought 
I have a couple more things that I could put in there. First, I got her this body lotion from Target, which I thought would be great if you're giving yourself a manicure or pedicure and you want to put some lotion on your hands, soften up your cuticles, and this was really cheap. It was from Target. You can get any kind of lotion you want. You can obviously find it for like a dollar in places, which I think is just like a nice little touch to add to any kind of kit. And then I also got this, which is called a 4-in-1 foot wand, and it has a brush, a rasp, a pumice, and a file. And I thought this was great if she wanted to give herself a little pedicure and it comes with like this brush and then it has like a pumice stone on it and I thought this was really cute and I really liked the pink one. So I know that that was kind of quick but those are the tools that I got for the manicure set. So like you guys can see this is, can be like a pretty inexpensive gift or it can be an expensive gift depending on what you want. If you just want to stick with the basics like the tools and everything you can definitely go ahead and give someone that gift and I think that would be great. Or if you want to include a bunch of nail polish which is what I did. I got a bunch of nail polish as well to add to it which I thought was really fun because I mean, I kind of think what's a manicure set without like nail polish. Nail polish is definitely optional, but I think that it totally adds that special touch, especially if you know like nail polish that they've been wanting or what their favorite brand is or anything like that. So these are the nail polishes that I got for my little sister. I'll just show you really quickly because I did film a nail polish haul video if you are interested. Then that will be up a couple of days after this one. So um, I just got her a bunch of China Glaze nail polishes to go in here because um, she doesn't really spend her own money on nail polish, but she really likes them. So I got eight of those to go in there. And I just think it makes a really cute, unique present just because for someone who loves nails and doing their nails and nail polish, I think that it would be really fun to receive. So that is my do-it-yourself manicure gift set. Or if you guys are looking for a manicure starter set, I think that those would definitely be great essentials to include. And I hope you guys enjoyed this video and let me know if you make this manicure set for yourself or for anyone else and I hope you have a great day. Also, I will have a nail polish haul up in a little while, like a couple days after this, showing what nail polishes I got if you're interested in that. And I hope you guys have a great day. Thanks for watching. Bye. Butter London's collection and it's called Trout Pout and it's super pretty. This is my favorite one so far. It's like this coral peachy pink color. It's kind of like a salmon color, um, which makes sense with the name Trout Pout. It's so pretty.